Once you're signed into Business Importer app, go to Import To tab. Click Upload a file to select the file from your computer, or insert the Dropbox or Google Drive link. You can download the templates right here. If you have several sheets in the file, please select the one you need. On the third tab, you can select the accounting company in case several of them are connected, and you are to select the right entry type. In this case, it's a sales receipt. And now you do the mapping, so you connect the provider labels on the left-hand side, which are the QuickBooks fields, with the column headings from your file in those drop-downs. The column headings are in the first row of your Excel file. So, in case you use our template file, all the fields will be pre-mapped for you. Once you've done with the mapping, you can insert the name of it to use it for all the subsequent imports of this file. You can also use the mapping helper on the right-hand side to double-check what QuickBooks fields you usually fill in. Click Next to be redirected to the Preview step. Note that the app differentiates between transactions based on the transaction number. Once the import is finished, you can check the results following the link right from the app. This is how your sales receipt will look like. Also, you can find them in the recent transactions in your QuickBooks, right there. However, if you don't like something, you can hit Revert Import and the app will erase all the imported transactions from your QuickBooks right away. Thank you for your attention.